What up guys, welcome back to another brand episode and welcome to my channel, Brian's Gaming Craft channel. And a lot of people have a um, question about the tech it the tech it um um running out of memory I did. So let's go ahead and I'm, I'll get into more detail this time. Cause I, I remember now last time I did not explain well, but so I'm gonna explain myself really good. Okay, so I will leave this link on the description which you should see these two things um windows offline 32 bit windows offline 64 bit so the way that you can tell what what bit is your computer is you go to your start this is actually windows 8 i just have mine's customized it to just act like windows 7. i'll probably make a tutorial how to do that okay so you're gonna go right click where's oh that's not my computer right click where it says your computer for this one says this PC so this should pop out and you should see there 64 bit I can't I can't click it but it's right there 64 bit let me just minimize that so we're gonna go to internet why is there and you know, that happening okay so we're gonna click to 64 bit I will leave both links the other this uh, this one or the media the media probably the media it will be probably faster so it's it's gonna be downloaded there mine's already download just install it just like normal thing just installing it and then you're gonna minimize it you're gonna open your thing um you start and you're gonna type java um just click really i think any i think java confirmation is the best one yes and you're gonna go where it says Java. Wait, is it Java or Advanced? Yeah, I think it's Java View. Here we go. Okay, so you should have. I don't know why I have another one. Of this. You should have this, but there should be nothing in here. Nothing. It should be just blank. <clears throat> so you're gonna double click it, and you're gonna write slash x m s. Um, and then the much the memory you want to give your computer the, the way you can find how much memory you can give your computer and put up a calculator real quick Does my computer? Have it? Yes, it does. Okay, so one gigabyte. It's 24 <clears throat> As you can see I only have four gigabytes because I'm in my laptop So I added two so you're gonna do that times two It should give you that that's how amount you want if you want to add like let's say um um let's say you want to add uh wait oh i messed up there whoa i'm pretty messing up um let's say you want to add like eight you're gonna do times eight a thousand and twenty four times eight that's the amount you're gonna put here so since i'm only gonna add two gigabytes so mine is gonna be 240 um, I forgot. I think it's 248. Yeah, 248. It says it right there. 248. Okay, so you're gonna type here slash x m s 2048 and then m and everything is together. So pretty much that's how you find the RAM. Just do um a thousand and twenty four times. I don't know. You want to give it six of RAM that's the the number you're gonna put and then once you put that you're gonna click okay apply okay and then I'm just I you always refresh my computer and then you're gonna open your tech launcher let me just close this okay so your tech launcher should be open should be loading up and you're just gonna go here where it says option, well it doesn't say option, but it looks like the option thing. And this should pop up. Now this should give you to add how much memory your computer has. You, you put for, two, let's say you put for two, it gives you two or more. It's gonna give you up to, up to, up to whatever RAM you have. I have four, but it only shows three because on my computer, it only shows um 3.46 gigabytes usable 
so that's why it only shows three but you should be able to close them and then you're gonna just click save and then you'll be able to play your games with no crash and if that helped you guys please make sure you hit the like button make sure you subscribe to see more videos helpful so thanks for all guys and see you next time peace out